this is H.C. Bailey, and welcome back to Let's Play Final Fantasy IX! What experiment would that be, Steiner? Magic sword? Whoa! Hey! Ho! Ha! Get out of my way! No! No! Not, not that magic sword. Although, I actually do like that game. That's a fun little, mindlessly fun game, but no. No, just kidding. Uh, but actually, now that I have my full party here, or, well, as full as it's going to get for a while, uh, I want to take a moment to uh, rearrange my equipment as I've listed in the video description, and I'll be right back. Okay, we're all set and ready to go. So, one thing I want to show you is equipping abilities in this game. I briefly explained it earlier, but now I can actually show it. So you go to Ability, Equip. And now Steiner here has some abilities that he can equip. So you see where it says 17 out of 17? You equip that, and it takes up three of his magic stones, or whatever those things are. So, might as well equip all of these on him. Uh, the killer abilities, they increase your uh, damage by about 50% uh, if they are of that creature type. So, that can be kind of nice here. So, that's really how Steiner gets a lot of his damage there. And, uh, yeah, so there we are. Okay, so let's move on out of here and rescue the princess. On the hum! And, uh, get out of here, too. Wasn't there someone that could restore my HP around here or something like that? Eh, I don't know. I thought there was, but... We're going to have another re HP restoration point soon enough anyway, so. Well, yeah. Remember that quote for later, goes against my nature. Just something to keep in mind, viewers. Or he's just a horny bastard, that too. <laughs> Bit of a womanizer, eh, Zidane? Well, not as much as uh, Sid in Final Fantasy VII. But I like Sid in Final Fantasy VII. He's, you know, well, not so much a real character, but uh, well, I just like his character. And not just because of his goddamn T line. I mean, he's also a very useful character. He's a 16-year-old boy. What else is he going to be thinking about? Oh, okay. A seed remover, huh? I think I'll pass on the obvious joke there this time. Well, because you're blank, man. That's what you do. Oh, I thought you meant a tip for the boss, not from the boss. Yeah, I already went over his equipping abilities. <laughs> okay, yeah, yeah, we should uh, get on out of here then. Oh, right, we did kind of quit, didn't we? Okay, well, I don't need to buy items from him, and the Moogle doesn't have anything interesting for us. So let's just move on through the forest, then. We can go a lot farther now, so. Oh, you know what? Me oh, well, we got an active time event. Hold on. Uh, oh, my party is already arranged. Uh, by the way, you can change the order of characters with the order command. You can do it like that. You can move from front row to back. I've got Zidane in the back row for now, because he's really going to be stealing, so... Let's see what the orchestra's doing back there. Hey, I remember that tune! I always liked Janan in Final Fantasy VII. That was one of my favorite areas in the game. It did have a lot of good areas in that game, I give it that. And ahead of Matsu, I mean, how do you beat that? Yeah, see if there's any loot, you know, we can take with us. I don't think that's the time to be playing such a cheery tune, but, eh, maybe it's just me. Okay, let's move along, then. Kind of looks like a little pond there, but I guess not. How do I get up here? Ah, there we go. Yeah, at least, at least it's not as hard to get up there as it was that pipe in Final Fantasy VII! What was that, Sector Six? Yeah, I think it was. But anyway, huh. No monsters. Well, it must be my lucky day! There we go. 
And we got a spring here. Oh, this is a forced active time event. I don't have a choice here on this one. What's going on, guys? Oh, yeah, soon enough, viewers, soon enough. Apparently, we're from some place called Lindabloom. It's a nice name for a place. Hail, Scroob! And apparently, Blank has a, a map to get around. Okay, so anyway, you look over here, and we can get a healing point. So let me just take a moment to rearrange my equipment for the upcoming part of the forest. Okay, we're all set and ready to go, but let's talk to this Moogle here. Oh, Monty! Yeah, we got a letter from Monty. Let's give that to him with Mognets. Oh, yeah, we all kind of knew a bit about that already, but... Huh. No, no, never mind. Pay no attention. Have you seen her? Apparently not. Now, sometimes you want to check Mognet again, because sometimes... Well, Moogles will get letters from other Moogles, not just what you you are delivering. So just keep on checking it out until you, well, until you get the same response over and over again. Well, well keep an eye out for uh, Stiltskin around there. Hmm. Anything else? No, no, that's everything. Okay. Now the changes that I made to my setup here are I've equipped the Rubber Helm on Steiner because it reduces thunder damage by 50%. And the same thing with the silk shirt on Zidane there. So, because, well, we want to have some thunder protection coming up here, so. Hmm, usually I run into more enemies around here. Well, apparently it must be my lucky day. Although I could really use the ability points, actually, but, eh, whatever. I would like to demonstrate some more enemies around here, but they mostly just, um... Whoa, holy crap, what the hell's that? The enemies around here are mostly weak to fire. I think I think they're all weak to fire, actually. So, let's see. Am I at full? Yeah, I'm at full. Whoa, holy crap! Sounds like boss time! Ha <laughs> ha! Let's get him, guys! I love how they start the boss music before the actual boss fight starts. I love it when they do that. It's such, it, it has to be good boss music, though, and, well, obviously Final Fantasy IX has that. So, let's get him. So, first things first, we want Zidane to steal from him. And let's take a look at that uh, so or magic sword ability that Steiner has. Now, basically, the way it works is, well, you just select it from Steiner's command. And it's like a dual tech from Chrono Trigger, where you have both characters use it. But it doesn't take up Vivi's turn, and it only uses up Steiner's MP, which is really weird. But, eh, that's the way it works. But I do want Vivi to stay on standby, just in case, because, um, you know, I might need some healing at some point. Nice thing about Magic Sword is that... It also bypasses hit percentage. It's a guaranteed hit, I think. So, even though he's inflicted darkness on all of us, we can still just keep on going with it. So that's pretty nice. You could also, oddly enough, you could have Steiner use Magic Sword. Hey, hey, all right, we got the Iron Helm. That's what I really wanted to get from this guy. But yeah, you could have Steiner use Magic Sword and have Vivi cast Fire in the same round, if that makes sense. But anyway, uh, this boss is weak to fire, so that's the way you want to go. Uh, let's heal up Zidane there too, because he's taking quite a beating there. Usually I've gained like a level or two by now, and I wouldn't be uh, this hard pressed for HP, but... Hey, hey, all right, Blank Man to the rescue. All right. Um, yeah, keep stealing there, and, uh, heal! Okay, we've gotten all the items from this guy. Yeah, um, we're taking quite a beating here. Holy cow. But we'll get him, we'll get him. Did everyone? Huh, that's weird. Well, anyway, I got what I came for, so, uh, yeah, is it on change rows? Usually I wouldn't need to change my rows, but we're okay, we're okay now. Uh, might as well use sword magic now. Whoa, holy cow! Watch out for that damage there. Okay, guys, let's get him! 
Yeah, it's a nice little touch that they put in there with Magic Sword. I wish it were more useful in the game. I mean, it's a little useful. You have to have both BB and Steiner in the party at the same time. And, uh, they're pretty accurate with it. Like, if uh, Steiner, or, well, if BB were put to sleep, Steiner can't access the command. So, they do put, you know, some effort into it. But, eh, could be better. Ow! Yeah, normally I'd have... Oh, right, I've been inflicted with darkness. Nuts! I might actually have to heal up a little bit. Um, let's see. Where the hell are my eyebrows? Ah, there we go. Okay. Oh, I should probably set the battle to uh, active time. I think I have it on wait. Oh, well, whatever. We got him. Hooray! Yeah, and I should heal up from uh, from that uh, darkness there, but I think we're in pretty good shape. Hey, uh, Princess, you uh, want to try some of my special medicine? It's got my special sauce in it, too. What's going on? Whoa, holy crap! Uh-oh. Yeah, uh, we, we might want to get out of here. But can we make it out of the evil forest alive? Find out next time on Let's Play Final Fantasy IX! This is H.C. Bailey, signing off. Have a good day. Yeah, I'm going to heal up and change my setup before next time.